dog inside it's still in operation and I think we're gonna come back and get a burger on the way back for lunch gotta check this out pretty cool and we finally made it into Piedmont Missouri it was about three three hours three and a half hours or so yeah we took our time so we're just uh, about ten minutes outside of our pickup heading through town we're gonna head towards the lake and We'll see you in a few. Clear water. Alright, here it is. It's an Enduro Racer. Mike's giving a little gameplay. Cabinet's actually in pretty good shape. Gonna give it the full half an hour playthrough. <laughs> Monitor looks good. Working decent good picture this looks a little dirty it's gonna show a little bit of the small town over here pretty much everything has been killed by the Walmart that opened up in town there's just not much left anymore and now the Walmart is closed so what little that is left <laughs> is well it probably should thrive now wouldn't you think yeah it's basically just restaurants and a grocery store that's left yeah one grocery store out of three the uh that used to be like the five and dime store there now it's a pawn shop a law office and an old restaurant pretty sad to see been, been coming to this town my whole life my grandparents lived here stores looks like it's still there oh no it's a computer store now hey stop at this uh, gas station for me just can't wait to get hello <laughs> i knew you were gonna do something <laughs> dumb welcome to arcade barn videos episode 19. this is the end of our enduro racer pickup we drove all the way to piedmont missouri which was what, three and a half hours away yeah something like that six seven hour round trip had fun, met some people, dogs and suds, said hi to your dad. Anyway, Dirt Race is back in the house. I got it here, had to do a few things to it. I was going to initially just take the board out of it. Well, mention that it, you you actually already have this game. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, quick little snippet. I picked up an Enduro Racer a couple years ago from a buddy of yours. 100 Sorry. bucks, wasn't working. Thought, oh, I'll get that going pretty easily. Well. Lo and behold, it's Sega. So no, I didn't. After a few boards ordered over the, you know, of a few people piecing stuff together, the board I had was suicided. I got to work a little bit. Graphic glitches. And finally, I got to work enough to where you could play it, but you couldn't see some rocks in the road, a jeep here and there. So you'd run into stuff on accident when you didn't really wasn't your fault. But. So I saw this, I don't know why I said that there, it, on the, I think it was on Facebook Marketplace, yeah, but it was so far away, I guess, right. bothered to, anyway, I keep what, making fun of him, I'm like, Enduro Racer? I'm like, why do you like this oh, game yeah. so much? Well, back what? in the day, back when I was a kid, the movie Can't Buy Me Love, um, if you all seen it, this video game's in it, when him and his best friend are going at it, actually it was a red-haired fellow like yourself. We just watched that recently. Yeah. You're like, you gotta see the Enduro Racer. Yeah, yeah. 
It's a great movie. You haven't seen it. Um, but the sound effects of the entire <coughs> race during the movie are a little different than the real ones. So I'm wondering if they added that. I'm sure. Anywho, that's that's why this has a little seminal place in my heart. And it's uh. So with two cabinets, you combined the the best of the best, I guess. Right. The original and... one, um, the control panel had an issue. This is all duct taped up. It was also the the start button wasn't here. It was on this control panel. It was right here on the control panel. And the other one was painted black, and they had accent of red here, here, and here. I didn't like that, so I combined the good parts of my other machine. I originally was going to keep it the other machine, but I looked at the sides and it, it absorbed some water. And it was swelling a little it bit. It swelled, yeah. So I thought when we first picked this up, I the pictures looked bad, and we'll show them at the end of the video. I was like, man, it's a $100 game. It works. You know, you spent $200 on a board already and had bad luck, so let's grab it and make your other cabinet the keeper and uh, we got there I was so shocked that here this thing is out by the lake in the middle of nowhere and it looks this yeah. good Wow. well yeah they wanted a hundred and quarter for it and we only showed up with a hundred dollars hoping we could talk them down and uh... the arcade cheap bastards well you know you gotta get your deals to pay for everything else alright let's fire her up and take a look I guess we do have a little bit of gameplay already that we've shown when we were picking it up well I was gonna put Steam monitor in it, but the monitor that was in it wasn't too bad after I adjusted it. Oh, that's the wrong one. Um, and it had already. It looks pretty good. Enduro racer burn, so I decided to leave it. Cleaned it up some. Uh, the reason, another reason why I abandoned the old cab, was that the original foot base of it was chopped off and this one even though it's got a crack and it needs repaired it's whole but yeah it uh... so the different control panel yeah this guy's off the one I bought for a hundred bucks and so is that basically the shroud and whatnot and I didn't change anything else out but I'm gonna probably harvest the speakers and you won't need a enduro, extra enduro racer cab. <laughs> Make a 16 one out of it. Yeah. But yeah, I uh, also got the best marquee and whatnot. Pretty fun game. Colors look washed out on the camera, but oh, that sucks. The road, the road's actually pink. Yeah, well, I just turned it on. It gets, you know, like anything. All the up. all the colors in this game to me look off. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, Every cool. PCB you plugged in, I've always thought that. So I just constantly thought there was something wrong with that other monitor. There's no turbo in this game. The key on this one is basically don't make any mistakes like that, or you're not gonna finish it next level. You can pop a wheelie, you gotta pop a wheelie before you hit your uh, obstruction or you, or you won't uh, jump or correctly. Cut that marquee out. It's a little better. Of course, you don't want to wreck. Like that. It's like outrun on a bike. Right. Jumps. It uses the same uh, scrolling type feature that outrun is when the original outrun. Well, basically, turbo too. I don't know why. What's it with Sega games? Why you can't keep your high score? You can't even enter. Uh, any I don't think any of them had high score save. Well, you can buy high score save kits for Outrun now, I think. Uh, but originally in the arcades, you couldn't save your high score. No. They just. They A lot of games you couldn't. And uh, that's, that's crazy. A lot of games don't have free play. Well, Taito games don't. So. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Later on tonight, we'll reenact your uh, Can't Buy Me Love scene, and I'll flip out on you, and you can throw your handlebars all over You can shoot on my house, man! <laughs> you shoot on my house. That's a, well, it, is, it is a little less dramatic. This one was a, a great deal, but it worked, and we just combined better parts on the top of it. And 
there are good deals out there to find. Yeah, this is finally, this is a keeper. And, uh, <laughs> For gonna, you. Basically, I'm going to strip the cabinet of the other one and keep on everything that's, you know, worth something. You know, spare parts. Spare. And then I, the cabinet will be up for grabs or hopefully it doesn't end up somewhere undesirable. <laughs> but, you know, we all have space issues, especially me, if you can see. You can get the Silenscope and play it, but you can't get to the fridge in the closet to eat your beer. <laughs> that's important. Yes. So we'll uh, we'll put some before and after pictures up after and this. And like, subscribe. Other way. Oh, like, subscribe. <laughs> You're too high. What? Do you like this? There you go. <laughs> exactly. <laughs>